Hi everybody, this is Mr. H and we're going to be doing a new rhythm game today. But before we get to that, I want to make sure you guys remember the names of the notes and how to say them back to me. So repeat after me. Rhythm, rhythm, rhythm. Long and short notes. This is a whole note. Ta. This is a half note. Ta, ta. This is a quarter note. Ta, 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 ta. This is an eighth note. T, 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 t. This is a quarter rest. Shh, 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 shh. Very good. I knew you guys would remember that. So today, we are going to be playing a game called Rhythm Mix-Up. In this game, I'm going to have a bunch of these different notes and their names on papers, and I'm going to mix them up and change up their order. So first way we're going to do it, I'm going to put up a few of these. I'll say the rhythms, and then I'll have you guys say them back. But after I do that two or three times, I'm going to put up the rhythms, and I'm just going to tell you to say it. Then I'll say the correct way, and you get to see how well you did. After we're done with that, I'll show you how you guys can do this at home. I'll also scoot the camera a little bit closer. I know these are kind of hard to see right now, but for right now, let's get started. All right, I thought we'd start out pretty simple. We have four quarter notes right here. I know they look kind of silly. I'm not the best artist, but you can all see they have the circle and the stem, and they all say quarter note on it. So if you remember, quarter notes, we do this, and we say ta for each one, so this rhythm should be Ta, 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 ta. With our hands, ta, 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 ta. You try. Very good. Now it's time to do a little bit of mix up. I'm going to take this down. I'm going to put up one of these. So we added an eighth note. If you remember, we have the eighth notes. We go like this and we say TT. So we should have ta, TT, ta, ta. Now you try. Very good. That's a really good mix up right there. Now let's add something else. Take this quarter note down. Now this is something new, something we haven't seen a little bit of. These are the quarter rests. So they are the same length as a quarter note. We just go shh instead. So let's take a look. We should have ta, ti, ti, shh, ta. Now your turn. Very good. All right, now let's really mess it up. All right, so we've changed it up. Now we have two half notes, remember? For our hands, we go like this with an open hand, and we go ta for each half note. So with just these two, it should be ta, ta. Now it's your turn. Very good. Now let's mix it up. We will add a quarter note and a couple eighth notes. So, we have half note, a quarter note, a couple eighth notes. Let's see if you remember what they're supposed to sound like. Ta, ta, ti, ti. Now you try. Very good. You're putting it together really well. I like seeing that. Now let's see if we can mix it up a little bit more. Maybe we can add one more thing. All right, so I added a quarter rest. We remember those, we go shh on those. So let's see if we can put it all together. This one's gonna be a little interesting. We have ta, ta, ti, ti, shh. Let's see you try. Very good. Let's mess it up even further. Take this rest down. Let's take this eighth note down.
And let's put up let's put up some more coordinates. In fact, we're just gonna do that. So we have ta ta ta. Let's see you try. Very good. Doing a very good job. All right. Now I took all the notes we had except for the quarter rest and I put them all up on the board. Let's see if we remember what they're like. We have this whole note here, this half note, this quarter note, and these eighth notes. So we're going to put them all together. We should have ta, 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 ti, ti. So we start out with a really long note, the whole note. Ta, then it gets smaller. Ta, and smaller. Ta, then smaller. Ti, ti. So let's see if we can put it all together. I'll say it one more time. Ta, 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 ti, ti. Now it's your turn. Remember the hand symbols and remember to say it. Here we go. One, two, ready, and. Very good. You really know your stuff. That's very nice. So now that we've done all that, I'm going to mix them up a little bit. First, I'm going to move the whole note. The whole note's really good, but it is kind of long. I'm going to add a quarter rest. Then I'm going to switch out this half note for another quarter rest. And then, you know, I think we're going to do this. There we go. I've mixed up the rhythm. Now this one, I want you to say it first, and then I'll say what it's supposed to sound like, and we'll check it out. So we have quarter note, rest, eighth notes, rest. Ready? One, two, you say it, go. You think you did it right? Let's see. It should sound like this. Ta, sh, ti, ti, sh. Think you did it right? I think you did it right too. That sounded really cool. Now let's mix it up again. Really quick mix up, but let's take a look at what we have. Quarter note, two eighth notes, and then two rests. Now it's your turn. One, two, ready, go. Let's see what that's supposed to sound like. We should have Ta, ti, ti, sh, sh. Think you got it right? I think you did too. All right, let's take out another thing. Let's add something. Let's move the eighth note. Let's add a half note. And let's just move one of these rests away. All right, let's take a look. We have a quarter note, a half note, and then a rest. So I'll do the hands, you do the sound. One, two, ready, go. Think you did it right? Let's hear what we think it sounds like. Ta, ta, sh. Very good. All right, let's mix it up one more time. And for that, we're going to move all of these down and I'm going to put up all of these you know what we're going to add one more rest so you have all these eighth notes and then a rest let's see if you remember the eighth notes so one two Three eighth notes and the rest. Let's see if you can try it. Ready? And. Think you got it? Let's take a look. T, 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 sh. There you go. All right. So let's say you want to play this game at home. You don't have to stop making music just because music class is done. If you look, what I did is I drew all of the note shapes and the note names on their own piece of paper. These are the regular like printer paper. 
but you can do smaller paper, you can do notebook paper, you can do line paper, you can even do post-it notes if you wanted to, as long as you can read it. Now, I'm holding these up using magnets on a whiteboard, but you can just put these down on a table and shuffle them around, and then you can make up your own rhythms with your family or with your friends. It's a good way to practice how to do your rhythms, and it'll actually be really important later on. You get to learn how to group them all together and what they're supposed to sound like. So, that's our lesson today. I'm very glad we had this time together, and I can't wait to see you again. Have a good day.